to my channel adventures with Amira. I haven't been doing a lot of shopping hauls for you guys because we really haven't been out much but I finally went back to Target today for the first time in so many months and they had so many cute Christmas items out we tried to go first thing in the morning and just get in and out of there really quickly I got some cute Christmas items I found some stuff in the dollar spot that I really love that I'm going to share with you guys as well as a few pieces of clothing and a few of the toiletries so let's get into it the first thing I want to share with you guys is this lovely little flocked Christmas tree now I love a flocked tree and I would love to have one in my house but I have this naughty little Dotson he's not and he gets into everything and I know he would just be covered in this stuff because he's so nosy. He pokes at everything that he gets near, like with his nose. So I thought at least I could get a flock tree to go up on my table. Target has these in the dollar spot and these are $5. They have some that are not flocked and they have some all white ones that I saw today as well as some silver ones, but they don't look exactly like this. They don't have the burlap wrapped around the bottom like this, but this tree is gorgeous. I just want to do like a little tabletop scape with this, probably on one of my bookshelves downstairs in the living room. And I'll probably add maybe a few little colored lights, but this is really pretty for like a desk or office. Next at the dollar spot, I found this little Mary sign. It's actually a little stocking gift tag, but I thought this would be so cute to do with a DIY. I'm probably going to add this to a wreath or put it in one of my little window scapes that I'm doing downstairs. And then they also have these beautiful little wreaths. Now I think these are so cute. You could use these all year. I'm going to be taking this off of here, even though I have a black and white kitchen. I'm going to put these in a different part of my house, so I'll be adding more Christmas ribbon. But I think I may use these all year in different parts because you can just add whatever season ribbon you want to. And I think it's pretty natural looking. They have some there in the same spot that look just like this, but they're lighter. And I thought they looked more artificial than this one, so I got the ones that had more green coloring. I picked up three of these for three of the small windows that we have in our downstairs family room. Then we went over to the Christmas section, and we actually bought a huge garland to go over our front door. So we also needed an extension cord, and our house is gray with like white on the bottom, and I didn't want green, but I know it's probably going to stand out a little bit, but I found the cutest extension cord at Target. I don't know why, but I'm in love with this candy cane <laughs> extension cord. I think it's so cute. And I told my husband, I was like, I've never even seen one of these. Do you think that we would find a white one or a gray one? And he said, no, probably only green or red. So I decided to opt for the candy cane stripe and I think it's beautiful. I don't remember how much this was, but I'm thinking it was around $14, $15, somewhere in there. Make sure when you're looking in the extension cords, if you're gonna be putting things outside, there are so many that look almost just alike. And some say indoor, outdoor, and some say only indoor, but they look the same. So I was surprised by that. So just make sure you get the right one for what your needs are. We also found these little wireless earbud cases and you can use them like on a key ring or just to attach to your backpack or purse or something like that. But we got one for my son and then one for my daughter. These are cute little stocking stuffers also. For the little wreaths, I also picked up some command hooks while at Target. Now I know that they have these in the Christmas section at Hobby Lobby, which is always 50% off. So sometimes you can find certain command hooks cheaper there but we went ahead and picked these up and I'm hoping they will hold. We tried some a few years ago for the front porch and they just did not hold well at all on our window. Hopefully this year they stick because I want to do wreaths across the front of the house. Also at Target, I found these little Vera Bradley razors and I thought these are so pretty. I actually got these for when I travel and I don't know if you can see this. Little flowers on them, on the little handles, the pink handles. And these are just regular disposable razors. And then they had these extra smooth Venus swirl razors. And I use these already, just not in this type. And I love the purple. Of course, you know, I love purple. But I've never seen Vera Bradley stuff there like this before. So I thought these were cute. I went ahead and picked these up. I also picked up some more of this native deodorant. They have new scents out for the holidays. We picked up both candy cane and sugar cookie. My daughter took the sugar cookie downstairs already. But this is the candy cane one and it actually smells exactly like peppermint. Like not peppermint essential oil so much because that's a lot stronger. But it smells like peppermint candy just like a regular candy cane would. How this will work as deodorant, I'm not sure. I really love this brand though. I always wear the coconut vanilla scent and it works for me really well. And I've tried so many others but the native brand is the only natural deodorant that I really use that works. 
So I'm excited to try this little Christmas scent out. I figure even if it doesn't work for Christmas, it will work good for like when you're working out because the minty freshness probably would give a cooling effect. And then I also finally picked up a few items of clothing. I found this beautiful purple blouse and I thought this looked somewhat professional or if I need to just dress comfortable but a little bit more dressy. And I love purple but I don't really have many purple clothes. And this is really big to be an XL. I normally would use a 2XL just because here, um, and I need more space, but this is an XL, and I could tell in the store, these look huge. So if I'd gotten a 2XL, it would have been swimming on me. So just be aware, this brand is called A New Day, and this is made in Vietnam, so maybe the sizing's a little bit different there. But it's very comfortable, very flowy. I tried it on and my husband liked it. And then I also got my daughter a sweatshirt. And I just love this yellow. She looks so pretty in yellow because she has really tan skin. I don't buy a lot of yellow things for me because I'm so pale. But this was $18 and I believe this was on sale for $14.99. But I got her this and it's really huge. It's oversized. The only thing is... She normally would wear a medium in juniors, but this was a large, and I got it because the medium was even shorter. I guess that's the style this season is like crop tops. My little girl, she's 12, and she is definitely not going to be wearing crop tops. She was like, Mom, no. So I said, well, do you want me to try to get it in a bigger size? And when we got it home, she was like, well, it's kind of like oversized, oversized, but she likes the length on it. So I'm glad we went for the large instead of the medium, especially if I wash it and it shrinks at all. I have so many clothes that I've washed for her that if they seem like they're a little too short or something, she just will not wear them. And I can't say I blame her because I hate being uncomfortable in clothes. So I totally understand that. All right, you guys have a great week and I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.